Now, as a member of Dr. Derek Health and Fitness, I want to give you all of the right information when it comes to supplements. Supplements are a huge industry. They've been around for a while, going back all the way to uh, different vitamins and minerals into more advanced things now. And the real key thing that I want to make sure that all of my clients know is, number one, I want to make sure that you're saving time. I don't want you to use things that aren't going to work or that are complete bunk. Number two, I want to be super respectful of money. don't want to just be wasting money on things that aren't going to get you towards your goal. And number three, and the most important thing by far and away when it comes to supplements, is we want to make sure that we only take things that could help us regarding our health and nothing that could potentially injure or hurt your health in any way. And when it comes to supplements, there's not many things that I recommend. Most of the best things that we're going to get are going to come from whole foods. Now, that being said, there are a few supplements that I highly recommend. I want to show you what they are, and I want to tell you why. First and foremost... Something that I strongly recommend is fish oil. You may have heard a lot about fish oil. In fact, you probably heard a lot of good things and bad things. Number one, all of the good things, it can help lower blood pressure, blood sugar, triglycerides, heart healthy, good for all of the cells of your body. Totally true. I couldn't agree more. At the same time, there's been reports saying that certain fish oils can actually be harmful to the human body, can be very toxic, and in some cases, increase your risk of cancer also true. Well, how can both of them be true at the same time? And the fact of the matter is, quite frankly, it's simple. It's the quality of the fish oil. Now, you might say, well, how do I know what kind of quality of fish oil I'm getting? Well, here's the deal. Most fish oil on the market is very low quality. Now, fish oil is an oil, and like any oil, it has a flash point. Above that temperature, it breaks down and starts to become rancid. For example, maybe you've cooked at high temperatures with olive oil. Now, olive oil is a fantastic fat loaded with omega-3 fatty acids, super heart healthy, until you go beyond 350 degrees. Then it will turn your pan black or your eggs black or flash up on your grill because it's not high heat stable. That's why there's a lot of other oils that are much better for high heat cooking. Now, fish oil, though, is the way in which it's processed. A lot of companies heat up the fish to extract the oil from the fish. In the process of doing so, they're turning the oil rancid. All of the good omega-3 and 6 fats that are inside the fish oil, the EPA and the DHA, super heart healthy, get wasted and potentially toxic. We don't want that. We want to make sure that we're taking in the best kinds. So if you've seen commercials for prescription strength fish oil, you might be wondering, why would somebody do that when you could just go into uh, a grocery store or, uh, or uh, a supermarket or a uh, a discount store and buy fish oil. The reason is because the prescription strength is totally different. It's high quality. Now, if you don't have a prescription rider, you're going to be paying about $200 a month for that prescription fish oil, Lovaza. You don't have to do that. If you get pharmaceutical grade fish oil in a must say so right on the bottle, pharmaceutical grade fish oil, it's the same quality as the prescription, but you can buy it over the counter. And a bottle like this will be about 35 bucks or so, not even close to that $200 mark. Probably uh, about 40% more than the cheap stuff, but in terms of quality and what it can do for you, there is no comparison. I recommend this every single day. I take it every day. My family takes it every day. I have three kids that are six, four, and two. They take it as well. Awesome for the hair, the skin, the nails and super heart healthy, lowers triglycerides, blood pressure, and will help you drop fat. This is what you want to start with as supplement number one. Now, the next thing, pardon my reach, here is protein powder. There are thousands of different protein powders, and they vary greatly. Buying protein powder is like buying a steak. You can buy a $3 steak or a $50 steak, and they're not the same. In general, proteins have two qualities. Protein isolates, which are high quality. Protein concentrates, which are cheap ones, don't absorb. With protein, it's all about how it gets into your muscle tissue. I don't want to get too boring here or too dry, but amino acids actually get into the muscle tissue. The concentrates, the cheaper ones, don't absorb. The isolates, 96% absorbable. That's exactly what we want. Now, also, the flavoring is completely different for a lot. Some companies use sugar, some don't, some use artificial flavors. In general, I'm looking for one that doesn't use any sugar, maybe a little bit of artificial flavors. You wouldn't want to eat it if it wasn't somewhat flavored and also can taste great and stand on its own. 
a company that I've been using for probably the past 10 years, is Metabolic Drive Protein. Super high quality, very low sugar, but their taste profile is exceptional. A protein like this is about 45 bucks, but when you look at a normal two pound container of protein, it'll vary from $20 to $80. $80 is super high quality. This is about half of that price, so it's right in the mid-level range regarding price, but the quality is that of an $80 protein and the taste is that of an $80 protein. This company only usually sells it to bodybuilders, and bodybuilders won't spend a lot of money because quite frankly, they don't have a lot of money, and they totally love this protein because it tastes good and it's high quality. I like this a lot, and I think you'll like the taste too. It mixes with cold water and down the hatch. No almond milk, no juice, none of that stuff. You wanna use just cold water. Your choice, four to eight ounces. I like it thick, so I like about four ounces. If you want it thinner, add more water. You can't hurt it by having water. Also too, protein shakes are optimum to have within five to 10 minutes after your workout or any time of day. You can't mix, you can't mess this up. If you had this for breakfast, if you had it in between your meals, if you had it before you went to bed, there's no wrong time for it. This is actually gonna be healthier for you and help you drop more body fat than pretty much anything else you could eat, including chicken and broccoli. Now, I mentioned oils before, and I mentioned cooking oils at high temperature. This stuff here is liquid gold. This is macadamia nut oil. Chances are you've heard me talk about macadamia nut oil. Worldwide, it's known as the new olive oil. And by new olive oil, well, olive oil's been processed for 4,000 years. This, of course, is a lot newer than that. Now, macadamia nuts have a higher profile of good heart-healthy fats than even olive oil. Hard to believe, and I love olive oil. This is even better for you than olive oil, but it's also better to cook with than olive oil. I mentioned before that olive oil has a flash point of 350 degrees. This is 510 degrees, super hot. You would not be able to burn this on the uh, grill top. If you make eggs, you're not gonna be able to burn it. Vegetables, you won't be able to burn it. I even brush this on the grill to make sure that the chicken doesn't stick. It, it, and I put vegetables on the grill too. So if you have a Weber grill that's super high heat and it goes to 500, 510, 515 degrees, this is absolutely the oil that you wanna use. I absolutely love this. It tastes like butter. I brush it, as I mentioned, on the grill, but I also too take a tablespoon each and every day. Some people think that's pretty viscous, but it's that good for you. And by taking it for about a week, you'll notice that your skin and your hair will get softer immediately. Now, one more thing I do want to point out, a meal replacement. Now, a meal replacement shake is not for everyone. Who should take this? People who don't want to lose any more body fat should take this. So if you're already happy with where your body fat is right now, and I know a lot of people have gotten to their goals, you could take this in between your meals. The reason why I'm saying that is there's a lot more carbohydrates in this than the protein powder. But if you're just starting off or if you're still trying to lose more body fat, you want to take the protein powder and not this. This is not for you. If your body fat's where it is and, and you like where it is, you could take one of these packets in between your meals. As I mentioned, there's a lot more carbs in here. There's 23 grams of carbs. That's kind of a lot unless you're not worried about dropping body fat. So only use this if you're already happy with your body fat. Now. Lastly, I do want to walk you through real quickly for any supplements that you need. Real simple. You're going to walk over and I have a pad right on the supplement counter. Just print your name and what you're taking and make sure it's legible and it will get billed to your account. No money changes hands. You don't have to worry about bringing in dollars or a check or, or a credit card. We can process all of it, place it right on your account. Any questions with supplements whatsoever, please make sure that you let me know. I'd be happy to go over all of this with you once again. I want to once again make sure that you're getting the most out of the supplements in number two, taking them the right way so that we get the maximum effect with the maximum amount of safety at the same time. Hopefully today you enjoyed this video. I'm Dr. Derek Alessi. Look forward to working with you and make the most of your life and live it fit.
Now, for some of you that want to go deeper and want me to help you put together not only the right nutrition and breaking down your day and eating the right foods, but also the right kind of exercise that you should be doing that's right for your level and your spinal adjustments in your skeletal system, click on the link below right now for a fitness and fat loss private consultation. We're going to go to work and we're going to break it all down. This is something that I do personally, not my staff, but I do all the evaluations ultimately figuring out exactly where you are, setting some goals to where you want to get to. You're going to tell me where you want to get to. I'm going to give you my recommendations on it. Looking at your health history, looking at your skeletal alignment, looking at your food, looking at your medications, looking at everything, and really moving in the right direction immediately. Once again, I'm so encouraged about getting results without wasting any time. I don't want to waste your time or mine. I want to start getting results and getting them immediately. And also, I want to influence it in a very positive way so that you can spend less time exercising, feel better, move better, and get to where you want to go. So click on the link below. Let's get to work on it. And this is the time for the best fitness and fat loss results. I'm Dr. Derek Alessi asking you to make the most of your life and live it fit.